Coach Jordan, uh, you guys are victorious today, even without two of your big guns, two state finalists, a champ and a runner-up, but uh, still, nonetheless, winning the 2010 Top Gun. Tough field, you know, CVCA, one of the top teams in Division Three, and Madison Perry, of course. But, Coach, huge three weekends in a row coming up next weekend. Going to have at your place, St. Ed's. Then, your place, the, the one of all, the duels of duels for high school. Going to have the Blair Buccaneers. Then, after that, Wadsworth. Coach, what are you doing, man? You guys are peaking for this. Yeah, what do you got to do? We're kind of banged up right now. My 60-pounder's out, and uh, he probably could have wrestled this week, uh, but he'll be back next week. And my 71-pounder is out. Uh, was out this week, so he'll be back next week for St. Ed's. And uh, you know, we're looking forward to the dual meet season coming up. We got the, the toughest, uh, I think, dual meet schedule around. Like you said, we got St. Ed's next weekend. And the following weekend, we've got uh, Blair yeah. coming down to our place. And then the following weekend after that, Wadsworth. So, you know, we're, we're just trying to peak at the right time. We're trying to get healthy. And I think we are we got through this turn without getting too banged up. So uh, next week, we'll have our full lineup in. I got my 12-pounder back. And I'm real excited about getting him back. He had a broken arm uh, before the season started. So he's got his cast off two weeks ago. And he's I set him out this week. So next week, we're going to have our full lineup in. And we haven't had that all year yet. So I'm excited. All right, uh, 130 pounds tonight. Bo didn't really, didn't really unleash anything. Didn't really show anybody much. And either did Skenesny. What do they got to do? What does either guy got to do? What are you going to do? Uh, you know, what do you tell them? I think they felt each other out, and uh, of course, uh, I'm disappointed. I'm, they might be disappointed too. But you know, Chase is a savvy. Uh, Nate is a uh, Chad, real savvy veteran, and, and uh, you know what? He wanted to win more. He rode, rode Bo, and. Uh, so back to drawing board, back to training. You know, same thing with uh, my nephew Isaac. You know, we, we beat Daly two weeks ago, and tonight uh, we just didn't have any offense going. So, uh, but on, on a positive note, Felipe won and, and uh, be the returning state champ. And uh, Nick Bruschetta and Ty Mitch had, uh, I don't know how many times they've wrestled now, but they're getting close to even, you know. So uh, Nick, Nick happened to pull that one out. So um, I think we need to get back to drawing board. We need to train a little bit more and uh, get ready for these next three weeks. How important, you know, if you were to say one duel is more important than the other, which duel is more important than the three coming up? Can you really put a, an important yeah, time on it? I say we trained for the Ironman and St. Ed's and then the state tournament, and this year's a little bit different. Uh, we backed off a little bit the Ironman. Uh, it's pretty much we're training for St. Ed's, Blair, and the state tournament. So uh, all the other stuff really doesn't mean too much. Those three mean a lot. Okay. Wadsworth comes down. Those guys actually train under your system in, yeah, in your I, camp I system. Tell you, you know, and I say those three schools, we can't overlook Wadsworth. I mean, right now, Wadsworth, they're on a high. They just beat St. S by 13 points. So, you know, the last thing in the world I want is by some chance if we happen to win the next two weeks and then all of a sudden take Wadsworth lightly because you can't. Because Wadsworth, Coach G does a great job with those guys and they got a great team. All right, how much hoopla is there going to be in St. Paris when the Buccaneers come you know, to town? We're going to have uh, a lot of people are calling and say, can we order pre-sale tickets? I said, we're not turning anybody away. We'll have people on the floor right beside the mat. and uh, It'll be a good atmosphere. And it's just a great opportunity for, uh, for us at Graham to have Blair come down. It's a great opportunity for our community to have Blair come in. You know, So it's uh, something to get excited for. Will you go back there next year? Yes, I, I promised Coach Bucks if he came this year, we would head to somewhere in New Jersey and find out where Blair, Blair's town is, you know? All right, Coach. Hey, thanks for the time. Congratulations, and I cannot wait for the next three weeks. Yeah, it'll be exciting. So we'll see you next week.